All right, breaking news coming in. Wholesale price-based inflation has risen to a record high of 15.88% in May on rising prices of food items and crude oil. Wholesale price-based inflation rising to a record high now. The inflation is at 15.88% in May on rising prices of food items and crude oil. Let's go across to Hina Gambhir for more on this. Hina, what do we make of this wholesale inflation touching record high month after month? Well, that's right. The wholesale inflation has increased to a record high of 15.88% in the month of May. And this is largely because of surge in food items, their prices and the price of crude oil. In fact, in April only, the wholesale price index had crossed 15% mark and the way it has increased in May, very soon it seems we're going to cross 16% mark as well. Now, this is definitely a cause of concern because it's been more than a year that wholesale inflation has remained in double digits. Now, yesterday only, we got the retail inflation data for the month of May, wherein there was a slight dip. 7.04% was the number for the month of May. And, you know, that was being seen as a silver lining. But looking at the uh, wholesale inflation today, one can say that probably that was just a temporary dip that we got. And the high food prices, high fuel prices are here to stay. They will continue to pinch us for some more time. Even even though the Reserve Bank of India has started increasing repo rate to tame inflation in just over four weeks, repo rate has been increased by 90 basis points. Uh, the impact on the ground in terms of inflation coming down will take a bit of time because economists believe that the kind of inflation fury that we are seeing in India is largely because of what's happening in the global market. And that's something that one can't really control. Russia, Ukraine in crisis is fueling the uh, crude oil prices that is eventually impacting our food prices because we rely heavily on the uh, import of crude oil so not very good news and we'll have to see how the government today reacts to this you know uh, just give us a sense of how this wholesale inflation touching a record high impact common people like you and me in simple terms, Rohit, when we talk about wholesale price index, it tells us a little bit about how the producers are uh, seeing inflation, what kind of impact inflation is having on producers. Now, this does not tell us what is happening with consumers like you and me, but if for producers, the input cost is going up <clears throat> The prices of inputs that they use for their uh, finished goods that we buy eventually, if that is going up, then eventually that uh, increase is going to be passed on to the consumers like you and me. There is always a lag here. So if there is, uh, you know, wholesale inflation rising to 15.88% in May, then it will be passed on to consumers and we will feel the pinch in the coming few weeks. This is what it means in simple terms. It also indicates that, you know, food and fuel prices have remained at elevated levels in the wholesale market. Producers, of course, are not going to absorb this price rise and this price shock for a very long time because it will eat into their profit margin. Then they will also be compelled to pass it on to consumers like us. So just going forward, our food bill, our grocery bill, fuel bill is expected to shoot up. All right, Hina, not so good news for the Aam Aadmi. Thanks very much for joining us with those details. Wholesale inflation at a record high at 15.88% in May.